Guacamole is a nutritious dip or spread traditionally made from fresh avocados, but registered dietitian Rebecca Turner here now to show us a twist on this classic recipe and add a little nutritious punch. Welcome, Rebecca. Oh, it's so good to be here. And yes, happy June Dairy Month. But today <laughs> I want to throw that twist on a delicious and nutritious dip. Sure. I got us started by actually um, blending a 16 ounce lactose free cottage cheese. Okay. Most people don't think about adding cottage cheese right. to their dips, okay. but this is the special punch. It packs protein, but with it being lactose free, there's none of the enzyme that actually can cause some of the tummy rumbling when it comes to dairy foods. So okay. you can feel completely safe serving this to all of your family without having to worry about um, any discomfort. Okay. So the next we're just going to throw in some simple ingredients. You mentioned uh, tacos earlier. Uh -huh. You said you had tacos. <laughs> we This would be great with tacos with the cumin in it, a little bit of salt. Okay. The recipe will be up on the website, so don't worry about keeping up with that. Okay. Um, and all you do, this is great for the whole family. I mean, it's as simple as measuring it out and then sticking it in. This is actually a cilantro paste. Okay. So for people like me who don't mind being lazy in the kitchen, getting a paste <laughs> instead of chopping things sure. can be an easy trick. Now here's an avocado. So this is what we traditionally think of when we think of guacamole. Right. It's heart healthy. It's got wonderful fats. It's good for brain development for kids. Um, but adding in the cottage cheese is just going to pack it with proteins the avocado don't have. Okay. You're going to take a good fresh lime and help um, preserve that avocado's um, freshness because we know that sometimes it can go uh, get brown. Okay. So you would just mush this together. Pretty easy. Pretty easy. Like okay. I said, you can definitely get your kids in the kitchen for this one. Okay. <laughs> and then when you're when you're done or it's mushed to your liking, you will add it to the protein packed cottage cheese. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely a spin on it. And I see you got some shredded cheese over you there. You got some to shredded cheese, it. and that would be the last thing that you're just going to sprinkle on top. This is going to add more calcium. It's just going to add add the cheesiness flavor because cottage cheese doesn't have that traditional like cheddar cheese right, bite. Right, right, okay. right. That this is a great way to get kids to eat vegetables they normally wouldn't eat. Okay. Um, and sneak in that nutritious and wholesome um, dairy food that they may not traditionally just jump for. <laughs> um, and this is husband approved. My husband ate it without realizing <laughs> exactly what he was doing. Well, if they approve, then that's it's, good to go. It, you have yes, <laughs> exactly. And so you would pop this in the refrigerator until it cools, okay. and then you so would, you want to and then you're going to serve it with. Okay. Um, whole grain chips or any vegetable um, getting fun and if you can just sprinkle it on top with a little bit of cheese and this is the finished product this is the finished product okay, your great. Um, guests will come running to it um, <laughs> and they will have devoured it before they realize what uh, the secret nutrition the secret little yeah, ingredient was absolutely so this is good for the you know chips or crackers and then I guess you could put it even if you were making a homemade taco it's good uh, for a spread and yeah. you are absolutely right it can be a spread for tacos um, you can eat it on a baked potato you can have it as a side for burgers it really is a very versatile versatile uh, dip. The favorite part, it's made in seconds and it's devoured in seconds. <laughs> and okay. it's packed with so much nutrition that your family really won't even believe that um, it's good for that them. They, that you tricked a little bit of the dairy in there. Okay. You, the dairy and then also the vegetables and uh, it's low sodium and it's good, it's good for the whole family. Okay, well good. So you got the husband approval. Yes. What do you get the joy approval? You, please, do I get to taste this you, on TV? Absolutely. So that's the thing about joy in midday. When there's food in front of me, I, I'm not gonna be uh, I'm not gonna be shy here. Let's just taste it and see. I'm not a fan of cottage cheese, but I, I trust you, Rebecca. Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Fix my lipstick. Mm. That's very good. See, it's the bite of and the lime mm -hmm. and the little bit of the cheddar that completely masks what we traditionally find as a cottage cheese flavor. But adding that cottage cheese breaks some of the fat in half because sure. traditional guacamole is packed with avocados, even though it's a healthy fat, it's still lower in fat content, and it packs that protein punch that just and it's delicious. So dip. crackers, and if you don't want to do the cracker, you can do vegetable. And you do absolutely perfect. Well, thank you so much, Rebecca. This is delicious. I'll finish the cracker on the break. Thanks for being with us.